fucking monkey ass head <coughs> bitch. What's up? What are you recording me for? <laughs> Three, two. Hey guys, welcome back to Cloudy Talks. Here with guess who? Wife. Hey, what's up? Hi. What? We're not doing a podcast. Uh, spontaneous podcast <laughs> because we just recorded a uh, music reaction and it was amazing. Y'all check it out. It's not bad. <laughs> It's something. It's something. So, um, <laughs> wife, what's been up with you? Not much. Work. More work. You being home. Yeah, I'm home for the month of January because uh, the vid, the Omi Crams. Omi Crams. The Omi Omarion. Cramp in my side. Oh my gosh. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, so I'm the home for the whole month of January, so I've been, like, knowing and bugging her all day long. It's been fun. Yep. And we got playoff football today. Um, Ooh. Gonna watch a bunch of football. Dallas lost last week. Oh, my gosh. It was <laughs> horrible. They played, like, dookie. It's one of those games where it's like I knew what was gonna happen. They were gonna play like crap on offense. They were gonna give up the big plays on defense and then it was gonna penalize themselves like eighty times the game. And that's exactly what happened. And when they give you a sliver of hope that they're gonna win at the end, oh my god and then like something silly happens, like the clock runs out on the last play. Oh yeah, that's where I I walked in because I was laying in bed. I wasn't trying to watch all that. Yeah, exactly. And it was just like, oh okay, well there goes the season. I mean I thought we'd at least win one game, like barely and then the next game, we'd lose in some stupid fashion like we did. But, yeah, we didn't give out a round one. So, very unfortunate. Yeah, I really care. So, who who are your um, Super Bowl picks, wife? Um, Those Vikings. Yes, Kirk Cousin and the Vikings, who are watching from home. Who else? Um, The... I don't know any other teams. Oakland Raiders. Perfect. That's too 100% true. That could happen. <laughs> the know. Raiders. Yeah. And yeah. I only know the other native ones, but <laughs> like the, the Redskins? What? Is that it? It's now Washington Red... football team. Oh, I was going to say Rednecks. That's not it either. Yeah, those... Those are lonely. I don't watch football. Yeah, so I'm, my predictions are it's probably going to be the Chiefs and the Buccaneers again. Chiefs, that's who I meant. Yeah. Ah, they still do that. The Tomahawk shot. Ah, that's funny. <laughs> that is funny and not I racist. I like that. I mean, yeah. It's you do fun. like it. Ah, I married you. Yeah, that's true. So, yeah, that's my pick is the Chiefs and the Bucks. Uh, run it back. And, man, I, can, I don't know if I could bet against Brady. I mean, if, if if they could beat the Rams, then they, I think they could beat Green Bay easily, easily. I think people are overestimating Green Bay, in my opinion. When is the Super Bowl? Uh, actually, I don't know, because they February? added an extra game. Usually, it's the first Sunday of February, but I'm trying to do the math and how many weekends are left. Uh, Maybe it is the first Sunday, but the first Sunday. February? Like, yes. That's usually oh, when it is. I'm just excited for Super that Bowl half Sunday. game. Did you know they did like a... Halftime uh, show? <laughs> the half game where they only play <laughs> half a game in the middle of the game <laughs> they did like a little trailer for um the performers or whatever did you see it no i haven't seen it either but um i a saw it trailer? on youtube yeah they did like a pre thing it's like a car i saw it was a car driving down the street or something for snoop dogg and all of them yeah i think i don't know if i've heard any complaints Eminem. about the halftime show performance or performance but i think it's because there's so many of them i mean yeah, it's I don't like know who, who you're gonna pick to complain is it missy about elliott i think it's missy elliott eminem snoop dr dogg. dre snoop dogg oh. and i want to say one more female i don't know i don't know but kill it's... Not, or kill that'd be cool mm, is that it? ashanti <laughs> ashanti <laughs> I don't think so. Um, I don't know. But there's always usually like one like surprise guest. So I wonder if they're going to have like Slash again come out of nowhere. <laughs> Janet Maybe Jackson. Axl Rose. Janet Jackson. That would be awesome. She pops out of nowhere. Like, hee hee. Yeah, that'd her be boom. cool. Yeah. Her She'll rest. never be invited back. <laughs> but, um,. Yeah, I can't wait for the halftime show. Ooh, either. maybe Fifty Cent I'm will really show excited. up. And you know what? I don't think anybody complained about the weekend last year. I think it did pretty well. No, it was cool. It yeah. was funny. <laughs> yeah, so many memes. 
Yeah, there's so many memes. Yeah. And uh, I like the weekend. They're at so I think the Super Bowl's in SoFi. So uh, SoFi. I'm, uh, in California, A. So I'm hoping it's like big. It's so like fi. it's uh yeah, SoFi Stadium. Anyways, I'm I'm expecting big things. Let's just say that. So I'm not. I work and I don't care. And what what are we gonna do for food? Oh, this barbecue. Is what I'm about. I want barbecue with mac and cheese, and the kids Ooh. will starve because they hate mac and cheese. Or, I mean barbecue. They love mac and cheese. I want yeah. some brisket, mm-hmm. some spicy chopped brisket. So if you all if y'all never had Rudy's, go to Rudy's and get one mm. pound of the moist. moist brisket and oh my jesus is it so good now all the other sides are dog crap that's the only bad thing about it you like you know potato I mean? salad their potato salads is solid now mm. i'm not gonna say it's amazing better than your mom's i'm not gonna say it's amazing <laughs> but it's solid okay because the, their beans suck they have like these weird butter potatoes which is like yeah. uncooked potatoes in butter goop it's it's like what they're like yeah that's what we're known for don't get it, they're lying to you. And then they give you like half a loaf of white bread, like the most cheapest, chemically fluffy, tasty white bread. It's good though. The bread yeah, is it's good. good. And the sauce isn't too bad, you know? Yeah. So definitely get that. And then, you know, I don't know what else we're going to get. Maybe some sausage or something. Because I've no, tried some of the other stuff. Their sausage is trash. Yeah, the sausage isn't amazing. I've tried their, I want to say like their ribeye or something. and Just stick to brisket. I want to say we even had the ribs and it wasn't amazing. I didn't either. try the ribs. I don't. I don't like ribs though. They're always weird. Swadley's ribs are trash. Vans were trash. Yeah, most ribs <clears throat> are nasty. They're like really hard and not very good. But yeah. the moist brisket. I mean, that's it's worth it to go there. Just get a pound of that and you're good. Piggy to piggy to piggy to piggy to piggy to piggy. It's piggy expensive piggy though. I don't think it's that expensive. We haven't been since COVID hit and their prices. I'm, I guarantee have gone up. I don't guarantee that. I do because I work in a grocery store and every meat has gone up. And you don't know. You work at a computer all day. Uh, uh, Rudy's yeah. is from Austin, Texas. Boo, okay. Texas sucks. So my point fun. to that is, is I don't care because it's a Super Bowl. Super Bowl. Anyways. Um, so yeah, that that's coming up and that's going to be super fun. Again, I think Bucks and Chiefs run it back. I wouldn't be surprised if Bills get in, but I don't know. Last time the Bills were in the playoff, they just seemed scared. Yeah. But ooh, we got to think of a dessert or something. I've been making make cookies. Something? I don't know. Oh yeah, you've been making a buttload of cookies. <laughs> I love cookies. Cookies. I don't know. Peanut butter cookies. You don't like peanut butter cookies? I do, but I don't want to make them. Oh lord. I want your um, mom's cookies. Make it happen, Mimi. Make it happen. Mimith. Send them to us via Dove. Okay, thank you. <laughs> With a um, branch. The Dove will be the meal as well. And we'll know that the earth is dry. And we could get out of the ark. Anyways, um, <laughs> so <laughs> Moo Moo's hashtag Luna hashtag Luna turned Eight, Eight months. Months. Yep. Yesterday. Aww. Good baby. She is a good baby. <laughs> she's a little cray cray when mm-hmm. you try to change her. Ugh. Wormy squirmy. Yeah, she's so wormy squirmy. <laughs> and I'll be in here like on a meeting, you know, in my room since I'm home from COVID. And in the background, I hear, ah! 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 And she does like random like screams out of nowhere. I don't know if the other kids ever did that. Just like, uh, why Why are we screaming now? What? I not mean, so much. No. Not, she won't even be playing. She'll just be like, yeah. I don't want to scream too loud because she's sleeping. The other but. kids were pretty chill, I feel like. Well, I know Sun was crazy. Yeah, to an extent. But this is like a different type of scream. I don't, she I don't just know has a lot of energy, it. I feel like. Yeah. That she needs to burn off. and Yeah. I don't know. She's already crawling and. She pulls herself up and moves around pretty good. So. Oh, yeah. She's speed racing when she wants to be. She just needs to... She's practicing walking with you. Mm-hmm. And she loves food. She loves electric sockets. That, and too. And trying to put her finger in them. That That's amazing. Too. Yeah. Yeah. She's a stinker. She's a stinker pot. Tired. Oh, you? Yeah. I am. I slept good, though, last night. I slept pretty okay last night. 
I didn't stay up too late either. I was going to stay up super late. She but... moved around quite a bit. Oh, did you? <laughs> oh, my gosh. She started at this and one end of her crib, and then I kept hearing her move, and she was she does not at the other end at all. facing the other side yeah. with her feet all crazy. I was like, what the heck? <laughs> yeah, so we bought a house with only three bedrooms, but we had three kids. So I don't understand how we're going to work that out, but... I think it's almost time for her to get her own room. We'll build a shed in the backyard and <laughs> move them all out there. We have a shed in the backyard. Make them pay rent. We could throw son in the shed, and he can <laughs> hang out with all the spiders in there. No. <laughs> and all the gasoline, and you know he'll probably find something to do in there. I mean, our room is like two rooms. Yeah. <laughs> uh, huh. We can find a cupboard like Harry Potter. Potter. So what do you think about Microsoft buying Activision in Blizzard? I don't really know anything about Activision besides like Guitar Hero. Was that Guitar Hero? I believe so. So one night, wife and came home, Okay, was over at um, my trailer when we were 16, before we were married, before we were dating, and she brought Guitar Hero, because mm-hmm. I had Rock Band, right? So we'd play Rock Band in one room, and then we'd go in the other room, one of the brothers' rooms, and they would play Guitar Hero, right? And this was around like New Year's, I think it was, or around the holidays. So my aunt was visiting yeah. from Texas in town. She's like my crazy aunt, right? Just like really like different and weird. <laughs> and so all the friends left, all the brothers were doing whatever. It was late at night. And she's like, okay, well, I, I guess I'll go. And my aunt was like, what are you doing? You better, it's night, it's dark, and I walk around now. She was like being really weird and like... <laughs> Like pushing me, she's she's kind of a hole. <laughs> I'm like, dang, okay, I guess I'll walk you out to your car. So here I am, we're sixteen. I'm, I'm walking. Not 16. Uh, yeah, you're seventeen. You're <laughs> old I'm <bat>. older. <laughs> and you cradle robin. Well, I'll walk you out to your little. What is it? The red car. That eclipse. Yeah, that was. A was piece it an of eclipse? Crap. A piece of crap red mm-hmm. car. I'm like, well, I guess I gotta walk you out. And you're like, uh huh. And I forgot what happened. I was like, well. Since I walked you out and it's night, can I get a smooch? God. And then she's like, mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it was so cutesy. And I had my little um, uh, braces on. Oh, and we yeah. Did our first little smoochies and I bit the crap yep. out of your. Which I think it was my braces, like, kind of clipped at your lip. You're like, oh my, you bit me. I was like, oh no, I'm a loser. <laughs> she's like, I gotta go. I was like, okay, cool. So I walked in. I was like, "Thank you, Aunt." And I was, uh, it was weird that she was like that, and she was like really adamant, like, "Go, you gotta go." And you know, she, she only visit. And then I hear a knock on the door. I open, and she's like, "I forgot my guitar hero." I'm like, "Oh <laughs> yes!" And so I go and get it. I'm like, "Well, I guess I gotta walk you out again, huh?" <laughs> Let's just say it was like one of those like really cutesy moments in our past. It was really fun. Yep. I think I was living with my grandma because I got kicked out of the house. And I think you was just so <laughs> taken back and you just didn't know your bearings or where you were and flustered. And, oh, please. Mm. I was like, this kid's embarrassing. <laughs> I was like, I gotta go. I gotta get out of here. I don't know what that was, but that's not how my books described it. Oh, gee. <laughs> you, you, <laughs> you read them sluz books back in the day, too? My romance books, yes. Uh-huh. I was supposed to turn into a werewolf and like... Slice you or something, and then hey, our high school had some of them books. Oh, I was about to say, where that's where I got them. Really? Uh huh. Oh my god, I'm like, oh, let me read this book, and I'm like, uh, (laughs) wait a minute, (laughs) is that how you started on those books? No, I think my cousin and my aunt, uh, they had some books like that, so I started with like historical romance, like Vikings and Native Americans, and Stuff like that. Oh, Jesus. Vikings were the coolest, though. And it slowly turned into half dog, half parrot no, type I, of... No, I've always read, like, paranormal romances. Oh. With shifters, vampires. But there's all kinds of tropes and genres now that... It's a lot. And you used to have a website, right, where you um, read independent pieces? Oh, f- fan fiction. Was that the website? Well, there's different kinds. I just remember one that you was like always on. This is like way back in the day before audio. Probably books Fiction and stuff. Press. Fiction Press, is that fiction the website? Fiction Press, yeah. 
And a couple of those, um, they're like legit authors now, right? Uh, Sarah J. Mass. She's a big, big time author. And she, I read her stuff on uh, fan fiction. She's, she's like top tier now. Now, was she actually doing fanfic or is uh-huh. it just original? No, well, no, it's origi- it was original stuff. It was that original? She did. Uh-huh. That's what Fiction Press is. It was original stories that you did. Fan fiction was based off of other stuff like TV shows, cartoons. I thought you knew someone who got big off of doing those, right? Like I mean, uh, New Moon? New Moon. Oh, Twilight? Someone. No. Not that chick. There's a... No. No. I must have been mistaken. You are. You don't read. Well, would you give your throat huh? to the wolf of the red roses? Oh, gosh, no. You wouldn't? That meatloaf song was weird. Yeah, it was. <laughs> uh, check it out. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh. <laughs> so what it is. It is what it is, y'all. It wasn't good. <laughs> Let's move past it, okay? We read your comments. We understand. What was your favorite comment from that video? It's not even out yet. Okay. Um, <laughs> moving on. I ain't got nothing. I got dry hands from this cold weather. Well, look at your list of topics. My topics? Yeah, look at the list. I don't have any. <sighs> Books. Make it up. What do you read? The I Bible. read um, usually the back of my wife's head. No. Oh. <laughs> I think I'll cut that out. <laughs> Whatever. What does that mean? <laughs> the lines in your back. Ew. Um, what? <laughs> make out or your hair. Oh. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> I connect the dot with your moles and I just. I put, I put. <laughs> <laughs> <You> jackass. <laughs> uh, I don't read. He should. I read articles. I read like new, news articles. That's yeah, what I read. Fox News. Yeah, what? Fox News, The Hill. I I read some Huffington Post stuff, some New York Times crap. Usually it, there's like a, a pay block or wall, ad block, block or whatever. Paywall, excuse me, to most of those stories, which is lame. I go on Yahoo a lot. I read like those little articles and crap. So I don't read a lot of that. Yeah, yesterday I was listening to a bunch of political crap, and I was kind of yeah. at one point I was like, okay, I gotta take a pause. Like, I think this is one of those moments where people tell you you have to take a like a mental health break from this crap. Because I was just like, oh my gosh, I really haven't been too big on music lately. It seems like I'm listening to the same like five songs, you know. Yeah, I know. The fray. I know. Jeez. I need to expand my horizons. Yeah. I agree. So if you guys have any music uh, suggestions just to listen to or even to react to, let me know. Comment down below. And I'll check it out and I'll like it. Watch a Peacemaker for some new music. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know what? Let's... It's got all kinds of... like. 80s rock, I feel like, slash metal. Basically, all the music Sneaky Ninja listens to. I think Firehouse. Oh. I think he listens to Firehouse. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't really think any of those were real bands <laughs> that were... I thought they were like no, made are, up for the show. Those are real bands, real music. Oh. Yeah. You should watch that show, though. It's pretty funny. Yeah, I've never I've been into the whole superhero thing the last few years. You know, I did the whole Marvel saga. Mm. I've watched like a quarter of those. And I was just like, oh, it's too much, man. Too much superhero stuff. It doesn't really get it. But I like James Gunn and all the stuff he's done. Mm. You know, um, the one with Chris Pratt. What's that? Guardians, Guardians of the, of the Galaxy. Galaxy. I really like those. So once I figured out he wrote it and directed it, I'm like, oh, yeah, for sure. I'm going to watch this. So it's John Cena, which is the main character. Yep. He, he's not too bad as far as an actor. I think he's pretty funny, and he really fits in the character. The only bad thing is the whole China thing. He pretty much like kowtow to China. China? Yeah, it what? was super weird. He called Taiwan a country, and then because everybody in China like basically pays his bills, he did like this 10-minute apology where he spoke in perfect Mandarin, apologizing, calling Taiwan a country. Oh, this is a real thing? Yeah, this is a real actual thing, and because... I guess he learned... That seems like something his character would do. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was super spooky. <laughs> it was like he had like a, a chip in his brain and they were telling him to like bow down and apologize because basically China wants to take over Taiwan and all those other Asian countries and they don't I want don't it recognized that, but as a country. <laughs> I haven't you know even what heard I mean? of this. Yeah. Where did you hear this from? It's, you, you could look up Fox the video News? of him mm-hmm. apologizing, speaking in perfect Mandarin, which he learned during his, his wrestling press. years oh. because they were like, hey, we're big in China, learn Mandarin. And so that's why, you know what I mean? And, and they say uh, half Ren. those sci-fi movies. They do pretty well over there. They do extremely well over there. That World of Warcraft movie, remember? I didn't even watch it. It made like, what, $100 million With Tom Cruise? In- that one? World of oh, Warcraft. World of Warcraft. Oh, okay, that crappy ass. I think it made like oh, eighty million awful. or something that in the US. It was an awful movie. It made like nine hundred million dollars. <laughs> I know Vin Diesel movies do in pretty China. good there. You see what I'm saying? And so it just kind of disgusted me. It's like ugh, yucky. So every time I like watch it, that's all I'm thinking about. It's like, dude, this dude. I've is never like, even heard of that. Yeah, so I don't think thing. about it. Uh, I wish I hadn't heard about it. I like the cast though. The rest, well, I like the. Well, I don't really know. I like the vigilante guy. He's pretty funny, actually. I like all of them except the the main blonde haired character. Oh, she the just, chick. Yeah, yeah. She, her character is kind of boring and kind of cliche, and it's like you could put any like blonde haired chick into the role, and it still would not be good. Like I don't know. It just doesn't. You know what I mean? She's like the one outlier. Almost. Well, I don't really know those comics or anything about peacemaker but he's not really like superhero to me he seems like just like a normal person with i don't know i don't really know what his superpower is besides killing people which he did in like the second suicide squad movie he's guess, pretty good in that yeah i don't know but yeah it's on hbo check it out it's not too bad we watched the first four episodes it's pretty solid it's nice you know yeah. It's not horrible. Like I said, crazy music and... Eagly. Yeah, like eagly is funny. <laughs> Your brother's probably watching it. Probably. Well, what is he not watching? Let's. That's true. Let's That's write that true. down. Um, <laughs> there's nothing we can fill out the list. Anyways. True. That's about it. I think that's about it, y'all. That's what's going on in Cloudy's life and wife's life. She's working. I'm working from home. Blech. You know, trying to do the OT, double T, triple T, but. Oh, yeah. We actually went to breakfast this morning the first time in a long time. We're trying to stay away from restaurants. But we had a big old nice breakfast. We had some lady like googly eyes over Muna, which is pretty fun. <laughs> yeah. We went to do some grocery shopping, and now we're chilling, like I said, watching playoff football. Boo. That's about it. I'm going to read. Wife's going to read. Or watch TikTok. And we've been stream. We streamed. Uh, I streamed with the kids the other night, so you guys um, keep an eye out if I randomly stream during like lunch or lunch, you know, hour, in the hour. evening or something. We might do some Fortnite, some Apex. Who knows? Maybe we'll maybe find a new game we could play. It'll be me, Lane, and Emery. Do a Nintendo game. Oh wait, you can't. Yeah, I know I can't. You'll get sued. Pretty much. So <laughs> y'all check out Twitch. Big. Cloudy Emerald. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? Keep keep eyes on the YouTube channel. We'll have some more reaction, more pods coming out. And uh, like I said, if y'all got any uh, reactions or even podcast um, topics, let us know. Send us off, wife. Goodbye. And keep it cloudy. Er. Keep it cloudy. Bye. <laughs>